Are you ready for round number four? I bet you are. So we have today, round four of the Pop King Paul versus the Grail Box Funko Pop Mystery Box Challenge. So each one of these boxes cost $100. Each one has a guaranteed value, a minimum of $100. The Pop King Paul box has four pops. The Grail box has between one and six pops. But this size box, there's gonna be more than one pop in there, obviously. So to kind of backtrack a little bit, in the first three rounds, Pop King Paul won every round so far. So in terms of the best of five series, Pop King Paul has officially won. Pop King Paul is the first ever company to ever beat the Grail Box in a head-to-head -head mystery box competition. Grail Box, until this competition, they beat Pop King Paul, they beat Ralphie's Funhouse, they beat Toy SA twice, they beat the Nerdy Newt twice. I think there was somebody else that, that they beat. Drawn a blank, but they they were like 8-0, or 9-0, I think. But Pop King Paul officially has dethroned the Grail Box. But, so as a side competition, to keep the competition going, at the very end, after the fifth round, we'll add up all the totals of all five Pop King Paul boxes, all five Grail Box, and see who had the better overall value. So that's still a side competition, all new competition, that could be anybody's game. But in terms of the best of five series, Pop King Paul has already won. But since Pop King Paul won round number three, we will let the challenger go first. So challenging Pop King Paul, the Grail Box. Yeah, Grail Box, like I said in the last video, they haven't dropped any boxes in like two months. It's been a while. I'm getting worried. Hopefully they drop some soon because I love the Grail Box. It's fantastic boxes. Even though Pop King Paul beat the Grail Box in the first three rounds, every Grail Box was over value from what I paid. So it was all good stuff. It's just Pop King Paul the first three rounds, his value outperformed the Grail Box. Here we go, here we go. Round number four, Grail Box goes first. That's the top of it. Let's see. They always use a lot of bubble wrap. Grail Box is never scared to use bubble wrap. Pull down more bubble wrap. More bubble wrap. Let's see, what are we having? What is this? This feel, oh, that's probably a t-shirt pop combo right there. Okay, there's a four inch, four inch, four inch. Okay, it looks like we've got a total of one, two, three, four, four inch pops and then a t-shirt combo. So this could get interesting. Uh, I think most of them are in pop protectors. I think I felt one not in, in a pop protector. It's this one right here. We'll do that one first. First pop out of the box, not bad. Agent Venom, a pop in a box exclusive. I know pop in a box, I was watching the Gassel cast. I guess they're officially like, not out of business, but they're, they're no longer selling pops. And they're called Pop in a Box. So I'm not too sure what they're going to be doing on their website. Here we go, pop number two. We'll do the pop t-shirt combo last. The back says Hunter Hunter. Hot Topic exclusive, Hisoka Diamond Collection. A 2021 pop, okay. These first two, probably not any kind of crazy value, maybe 20 bucks a piece maybe i'm not 100 sure here we go next one the back says pokemon we have pokemon pidgeotto i have no clue i do not know the pokemon characters pokemon pidgeotto I probably butchered that right here we go last one then we'll do the t-shirt combo well, that's a decent one. Eevee, 2020 Wonders Convention, shared sticker, flocked Eevee. It's not bad, not bad. I'm guessing here's like 30, 40, 60, maybe $75 here, I'm guessing. So we have a guaranteed of at least my money back. This one feels like a t-shirt combo. You ready? It is, what do we have? In a Suki Hashibiria Demon Slayer, I have no clue on value. Appears to be a GameStop exclusive. This came out in 2021. Size extra large t-shirt pop combo. 
demons. I know this is a very, very popular TV show. So that's all five pops in the growl box. Let's go. Let's see some PPG value. First pop, we got Agent Venom coming in at $21. Next, we've got Hisoka coming in at $16. Next pop, Pidgeotto? Pidgeotto? No clue. Coming in at $11. Next, we got Eevee Flocked, Winners Convention Exclusive, coming in at $32. The T-shirt pop combo pack of Insuki Hachi Biria coming in at, if it's still sealed, at $43 of grand total of Grail Box, $123. So that's still pretty good value. I spent $100. I got back $23 over PPG. That's not bad. No, no massive pops in that one. But once again, everything was overvalued what I paid, over guaranteed value. So now we have Pop King Paul coming in with round number four. He's dominated this competition so far. He's absolutely dominated it. Here we go. Round number four, Pop King Paul Ball. This one only has four pops in it. Weight-wise, I don't, I it doesn't feel heavy on any corner, so there's probably no pop stack or hard stack in here. I think the last box, there was a pop stack in it. This one, it doesn't feel like any corner is heavier. At least it, that's not how it feels. Here we go. Pop King Paul. $100 box. Guarantee your money back in terms of value. Let's see. Bubble wrap on top. Let's pull that back. Get to the pops. Feel around. And four pops, of course. All four are in soft protector. So I have no idea which one's going to be the best one. Let's start from this top side and work our way like clockwise how's that sound yeah here we go first one psylocke x-men had a thing about how to pronounce it. i think it's pronounced it right psylocke this is a 2016 seven year old pop pbg value day packaging was 30 bucks so that's not bad looks to be in pretty nice shape i know marvel pops sell really really well really really well here we go next one Back says Superman. We have, I've never seen this one in person. Funko exclusive 618. It says it's worth $41. Even has that overseas sticker, uh, sticker on the bottom of it. Funko exclusive 618. Never seen this one before. At least not in, not in person. Okay, first two we're looking at, there's like 71 bucks. Here we go, pop number three. Back says Garbage Pail Kids, and we've got Clark Kent. This is a 2018 five-year-old pop. Small little corner ding right there on it, but it's not too bad. Not too bad. It'll still be like 8 out of 10 condition. Okay. Clark Kent, $23. They were looking at like, what, $71, $81, $91, $94. So, how much was... Grail box was $123. What did I just say? 194. So this pop has to be worth around 30 bucks for Pop King Paul to take round four. It's got to be at least like 30 bucks. You ready? Here we go. Round number four, last pop. That's a good one. We got the governor, the bloody governor. And ooh, that says $60 on that one. Nice. I think Pop King Paul took round four, it looks like. Absolutely dominating the competition. Let's see PPG value of these four pops. First pop, Clark Kent, 23. It's actually got up now to $24. Psylocke is still worth $30 PPG value. Superman, the Metallic Imperial Palace, actually dropped in value, 41. Now it's worth 36. And the Governor, Bandage Bloodied, Coming in at 60 bucks, value has not changed. Grand total for Pop King Paul, exactly $150. So Pop King Paul took round number four. Every single round so far. He, he's got a four for four sweep. Um, the Grail box still was way over value. It's just Pop King Paul, at least in this, in this series, his value is over the Grail box's value. So 
First four, Pop King Paul won all four. There is only one round to go. One round. So I think grail box is going to have to have, the last box is going to have to be a pretty big grail in it in order to catch Pop King Paul in terms of overall value. Because Pop King Paul right now has been more in value in every single round so far. And he's obviously won the overall competition of the best of five series. Right now, he's he's 4-0. So any of these pops you would like to purchase, I sell exclusively on the Whatnot app now. All my pops and comics only on Whatnot. I auction live every weekend. There'll be a QR code on the screen right now. You can use a QR code, download the Whatnot app, and if you use my QR code or the link in the description box of this video, either one, you'll even save 15 bucks on your very first purchase on Whatnot exclusively through my link or QR code. So if you buy this pop for full PPG value, it's say $24. You save 15 bucks, you get it for only $9. So not a bad deal, right? You actually might even get your first pop for completely free if it costs you around 15 bucks. So use my QR code or link down below and your first purchase, depending on price point, could be completely free. So I'll see you in a future a What Not Live auction. Thanks for watching. Love the chase and the hunt and I set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want and I always give it 100. Don't need a bank, no I'm funded. Play the game like it's nothing.